Hello everyone, uh, Kitsukyo here, and uh, welcome for uh, this reaction video, which uh, I'm a bit late to record, I'm sorry about that. Uh, but yeah, I'll be reacting to the Nintendo Direct that happened today uh, on the 21st of uh, June. Yeah, okay. Sound should be good. Okay, Pokemon. Nice. I'm reacting on the French channel because I mean, the audio is still in English and there's no subtitles for the English version, if I'm not mistaken. So... Might as well watch it in French so I can fully understand it more as well. Okay, well... Pokemon. Okay. I have no idea what they're going to do. I mean, right now they're, they're like talking about the DLC, so. Who's that? And uh, also, I'm sorry if my audio is not as good as usual. My. Um... Actually, I might as well use the English version. That's okay, we're not gonna miss much. We're speaking about. You don't see anywhere they're like showing images of it. I'm probably not gonna buy the DLC anyway. I have Pokemon Violet. Uh, I enjoyed it a lot, but well, um, I don't buy DLCs often, so. So it looks pretty cool though. Looks very cool. So, there's that. Yeah, my headphones are dead, so unfortunately I have to record it like this. That's an interesting look for the legendary. Blueberry Academy. Okay. I don't think all of those Pokemon were present. The actual game, so then that means they're going to add new Pokemon from previous generations. We'll look at some of the characters that will be. You all see? Oh. I think they showed this, all this, uh. Not, and not anything, not anything new. We already. Hello, everyone. Showed I'm that. Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be one of your guides for today's Nintendo Direct. Hello. I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi, and I'll also be joining today. Okay. That was the latest trailer for the hidden treasure of Area Zero, the paid DLC for the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. Yeah. The first half of the trailer took place at a festival in the countryside. Hmm. While the second half seemed to be in a completely different location, a futuristic academy in the middle of the ocean. More details on this DLC will be available in the future. Okay. And after today's Nintendo Direct, a special event will be held in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. We hope you'll participate in it. I okay, won't. <laughs> let's see our first batch of headlines. I don't have Nintendo online, so. It's I, I saw that game too. Squad of superstars. It's been announced a few Sonic days ago. Sonic and friends are spin dashing into a brand new 2D side-scrolling game, Sonic Superstars. Twelve brand new zones await. Speed through beautiful worlds as Sonic. Take to the skies as Tails. 
scale walls and glide. As yeah, I, I think they're, they're going to talk about Zelda again. Powerful hammer as Amy Rose. Uh, probably going to make an announcement like the DLC already. By harnessing the incredible power of the Chaos Emerald. Uh, maybe DLC for Fire Emblem. I, I know there has already been DLC for and Fire Emblem. So the more recent one. I'd like a new Mario, Mario game, like a, a 2D or 3D one, I don't care, just a new Mario game, it would be nice. Uh, information information's about Metroid Prime, maybe one day. Uh, one can hope, for those who are fans of the series. Uh, the Pikmin game, maybe some... Has it been out yet? I don't remember. A cozy life is just around the corner. Welcome to Palea. In this free to play Paleo. adventure sim, create the idyllic life of your dreams alongside in game characters and My God, there's a from fox. all over the world. Build houses, decorate your home plot, throw crops yeah, in your garden, and more. Play with other residents in online co op or carve out your blissful life solo. And if you're eager to explore, there's plenty of life beyond it's, the it's village. It's like Animal Crossing Set Stardew Valley. Set a vast journey games. to uncover Palea's many mysteries. Or just kick back and relax at it's home. Like more multiplayer How focused. you live is entirely up to you. What kind of coziness will you oh, choose? Earth. Nice, Palea I will play this game. Play and launches on Nintendo Switch this holiday. Ignite your heart. Persona, okay. The Phantom Thieves return in this tactical spin-off of Persona 5. Nice tactical RPGs for the way. group ends up in an unfamiliar world, they nice. must join uh, forces with a revolutionary named Arena to combat the armies that have taken control. I really control. like tactical RPGs on the big kind of power. During battle, assess the situation and determine whether to unleash an attack up close, from afar, or using a Persona. I don't know much about Persona though, other than Jokers and Smash, and the music's sort of kind of cool, but that's pretty much it. Then surround your foes and take them out with dramatic flair using the new all-out attack, Triple Threat. Triple Threat, that's the fusion ability it's a wrestling from the term. Persona series returns, allowing you to combine Personas to form other ones. Yeah. What is Arena's true objective? And what truths lie hidden in this strange world? A revolutionary tale will ignite when Persona 5 Tactica launches on Nintendo Switch November 17th. November 17th. For the physical version of the game begin today. <laughs> Please check your local retailers. Okay. Step into a Saturday morning cartoon. Calling all heroes for the first person roguelike adventure, Myth okay. Force. Enter a high fantasy world inspired by Saturday morning cartoons of the past. It's up to you to stop the evil Daedalus from taking over. I mean, that's but definitely it won't be easy. Our style. Treacherous tombs and cryptic castles threaten your it. survival. Wield it's something different, so being different is the idea. To smite hordes of monsters. During each run, not, not my type of game though. to help boost your character's abilities, yeah. weapons, and more. Plus, up to four brave heroes can share the adventure in online co-op. Drop in and out at any time as you face the many perils ahead. By the power of teamwork, MythForce launches on the Nintendo Switch system this year. This oh, black vest is going Splatoon. to be pretty sweet. Splatoon Cafe Remix. Nope. The next Black Fest for the big three game better switching up or play the game, but they don't really okay, squids. Here's the interest me. Which flavor of ice cream is best? Vanilla, strawberry, or mint chip? Vanilla. This black fest will be held during the dates shown on no screen. No question. I don't like mint, so that one's out of the question. Mm, and strawberry is fine, but delicious. Vanilla. Got your favorite flavor to victory. 
hit splatting and themed battles with challenges. More splat-tastic events are on the way. Be on the lookout for more info in the future. Another Pokemon thing. Where is that? Pokey Park. To promote an even stronger bond between the people and Pokemon of Rhyme City. Detective Pikachu. This day, the start of Pokemon Friendship Week. Yeah, Detective Team Pikachu. Goodman. Okay. Pikachu. You two are the ideal detective duo. Disguises okay. are a key part of detective work. Quit goofing off and investigate. I haven't played the game, but I, I uh, saw the so much for my coffee. The movie. Something tells me. Was pretty cool movie. This is just the beginning. A light roast today, huh? <laughs> I'm not sure if I would play the game. There is something the two of you must know. You too, based on our deductions, the culprit is clear, isn't it? A bolt of brilliance. The name's Pikachu, and I'm what you might call a great detective. Okay. I sure wish somebody would bring me some coffee. That was Detective Pikachu returns. At least Pikachu has some character, but looks like just he not a still fan loves coffee. Of the concept what cases of the game. will Tim and this tough talking Pikachu solve together? More info will be revealed in the future. Next, please take a look at this. A Super Mario RPG, okay. I think. Oh, Super Mario RPG Remake? That's interesting. Yes, okay. I like the art style. It's different. played the game but I know that people wanted Gino from the game's being smash. Which I don't understand why I mean maybe he's an important character in the game, I'm guessing, but like make <laughs> having like a character which appeared in like one game of the series into the into a franchise such as Mad was especially a character which was from a game which is not as well known as, for example, uh, uh, Super Mario Galaxy from which Rosalina is from. It's November. Originally released on Super NES, Super Mario RPG Returns. And Rosalina was in Mario Galaxy 2, I believe. I haven't played Whether you played the original game sure or not, why not take the opportunity to jump into the very first RPG in the Mario series? Shows like so many uh, of the Mario spin-off games. That last trailer featured Mario, but he's not the only one getting a game. Huh? What do you mean? Let's take a peek. Take a peek. Peach. That's right. Princess Peach will star as the main character in a brand new game. Oh. When she steps on this particular spot on stage. Huh? Whoa. What on earth is happening? That's all we'll show for now. 
We'll share more details at Super a later Princess date. Peach 2? Mr. Koizumi, there's actually something else. What? <laughs> Luigi's Mansion. Ooh, the FPS. The visually enhanced version of Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, I mean, originally early released on Nintendo 3DS, is in development. We hope you look forward to seeing more of Luigi's ghostly antics. So, like, all the Mario characters are getting their games. Both games will launch next year. But no new games, so that's a bit unfortunate. I mean, this, and Luigi. this one. Looks like Mario fans have a lot of games to look forward to. More details will be shared in the future. All right, let's see some more headlines. Become Gotham's I'm best man. ultimate protector. Okay. Wake up, Mr. Wayne. We have Our much to discuss. Silence. I want you to know the fear that is coming. This is the beginning award winning the end trilogy. You, Dark Knight. Oh, so, okay, so it's like You're all Arkham. Uh, I know there's Arkham Knight, Arkham. You still know how to make an entrance. City? Welcome to the madhouse, Batman! Arkham is Island. Big homecoming and you're the guest of Soon I will command forces beyond your comprehension. Yeah. I've waited long enough. Batman dies tonight. Trying to Nintendo Switch. Dangerous. Okay. I know that they're very good games. It's nice that they're coming to Switch, I guess. Don't be a stranger. You're always welcome here. Batman Arkham Trilogy launches on Nintendo Switch this fall. This fall. Play your cards right, mercenary. Hmm? Lead your mercenaries through cursed dungeons in the lands of Gloomhaven. Your tactical prowess is all that stands between riches and certain death. This another? adaptation of the hit board game features turn-based card battles with RPG elements. Unleash deadly combos and bring doom upon your foes. But beware, exhaustion is close at hand. Choose from 17 different mercenaries, brave over 260 grueling missions, and master over 1,000 abilities. Hone your deck, set up synergies, and gain every advantage sure. to survive. Grit your teeth and earn your keep when Gloomhaven launches on the Nintendo Switch system September 18. Pre orders for the mercenaries and gold editions begin today on Nintendo eShop. Keep the dance party going. That's the moment to get copyrighted. I'll just do that for now. Um, I don't want to get problems with YouTube. I mean, I will, but I don't want to get too much, too many problems. Okay, well. Just Dance 2024, there you go. Oh, that, that I know. I want to mess with somebody. It's pretty cool. How you like that as well? I know that one. I know this one. I know like two songs from the ones, ones they showed. I like the fact that you can access old songs from the previous games as well. And hope lies in a world without words. One day, a once peaceful realm was silenced by its king. Now, seven wordless warriors will rise. In this action RPG, these heroes bound by fate must work together to explore the abyss and find the secluded king. However, with its ever-changing dungeons and powerful foes, 
Conquering the abyss will be no easy feat. Okay. Real weapons RPGs. like swords, bows, magic, and more to survive this deadly chasm. After you return to base, materials you've collected will help you cultivate resources. I think the first part they showed of the game which was like in 2D. Repeated for But then into this game, it's like, enable you to grow feels stronger, like a very gene generic game <laughs> design, so. Can you hear me? Your guide on this journey is the kingdom's sorrowful princess, encased in a crystal of her own tears. And really? And mysterious power, her voice reverberates in the hearts of the silent warriors. Why sure she's the like king a steal the world's words? And what awaits the warriors in the depths of the abyss? Silent Hope dives villain, onto maybe. Nintendo Switch October 3rd. Hey, she could be. Sparks will fly in these Nintendo Switch games. Cast spells and cultivate your best life in Fae Farm. Make use of magic to complete tasks and fend off mischievous foes. Enrich your farm to help your character flourish. Decorate your space to improve your stats for the day ahead. Okay. And enchant your friends locally or online in four-player co-op. Bay Farm launches as a console exclusive on Nintendo Switch September 8th. I'm not very interested in games like including this. an in-game bonus are available now on Nintendo eShop. Wow. Zoom into wild racing action with Hot Wheels Unleashed 2 Turbocharged. Choose from over 130 vehicles and pull off outrageous stunts to avoid obstacles. Wow, how outrageous. And knock your rivals out of the way. Unleash your creativity by modifying your vehicles and building your own tracks. That's cool. Race though. locally with friends and split I'd like to build car. my own tracks in Mario Kart, though. So. players can hit the track I feel online. that the track maker would be very limited. Speeds onto the Nintendo Switch system because Mario Kart is not, not only about the track; it's it's also about Get like the, looking classy in the environments all around it. So making your Grab own track part, would be very limited. Fix it up and toss it over. Repair vehicles quickly to earn points in solo play or for the co -op. Yeah, yeah, sounds. But works. watch out for treacherous pits, pesky UFOs, and other workplace hazards. Manic Mechanics launches first for consoles on Nintendo Switch July 13th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Introducing the second paid DLC for Mario plus Rabbids Sparks of Hope. Thank you. Mario and friends journey to a musical planet filled with new areas to explore and new enemies to battle. What else will they find in this world of melodies? This King new Ball. DLC, The Let's Last Spark Hunter, launches later today. A demo of the main game is available now on Nintendo eShop. Dragon Quest. Okay. The art style of the monster, monsters is very recognizable. You intend to take arms against me? Very well. Though I'm not familiar with like the game on the DS, which was Dragon Quest Monsters Choker. You are now cursed, unable to harm monsters. <laughs> You're going to have to become a monster wrangler. Wait, is that? Is that Dragon Quest monsters? If that's the case, I fucking love it. Is that really the case? Oh my god. That's so fucking cool. That's so fucking cool, no really. Uh, the so-called hero is here. I don't know anything else about the Dragon Quest franchise other than this game on the DS, right, but that's that was Dragon Quest Monsters, the Dark Prince from Square Enix. What kind of journey will you take to become the master of monster kind? 
please be on the lookout for more info in the future. Next, we have more news on a certain game with plant-like creatures. Plants versus zombies. No big That makes sense. Welcome to the Rescue Corps. Hey, it's good, As its then. newest recruit, you'll venture to a mysterious planet with all sorts of life forms. There, you'll meet plant-like creatures called Pikmin. And the adorable rescue pup, Ochi. Good boy. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, repair the damaged I mean, rescue core space. Otherwise, you wouldn't have bought the game. So. You find. All right, let's explore. Might as well accept together. the quest. Once plucked, Pikmin are ready for action. Blow your whistle to gather them and have them follow you. Throw your little buds at things, and they'll little start working buds. for you. Ochi will also prove to be a great canine companion. He can carry items with Pikmin. Or smash obstacles in your way. And if you need a flotation device, well, there you go. Ochi can even stand up to the wildest creatures. Collect lots of treasures scattered around the planet to fix the space Game Boy radar says SP and to be more precise. New areas to explore. Exploration isn't limited to the surface, though. Why not take the plunge underground? Here, a completely different environment awaits. Hmm. Unusual contraptions. I guess that's interesting for people who are really of series. And even more treasures are around every corner. You might unexpectedly find some castaways, too. Hey, wait a minute. This leafy individual just nabbed the castaway. You've got to stop him. It's time for a Dandori He's a bad battle. guy. Castaway, that's, that's a survivor reference. By strategically issuing commands to your Pikmin and Ochi. No, it isn't. Collect more objects than your opponent within the time limit been. to win and save the castaway. By rescuing castaways, you'll be able to do more activities back at base camp, which is right next to your spaceship. Train Ochi and teach him new skills. Or build new equipment and items to help make exploration more manageable. For the first time in the Pikmin series, you can eventually set out for night expeditions. But there's a catch. Nightfall sends creatures into a frenzy, so stay alert. Thankfully, you'll come across the new Glow Pikmin, which only appear at night. Find luminols that produce valuable glow sap. These mounds also attract various wildlife, so use glow pikmin to drive them away and protect the luminols. Many more surprises await on this uncharted planet. Oh, I spent a really long time on this game. But with the pikmin and Ochi by your side, currently no the direct is about 40 big. minutes long, so like. 1628 right now, so it should be over in like Pikmin 10 minutes. Four. Launches in a month. In past Pikmin games, you had to return to your spaceship before sundown. However, in this latest entry, you can now venture out at night. We hope you can lead the Pikmin on your expedition. We have even more Pikmin news to share. Oh. HD versions of the first two Pikmin games originally released on Nintendo GameCube will launch on Nintendo eShop later today. Okay. Plus, ahead of the game's release, a demo of Pikmin 4 will be available on Nintendo eShop on June 28th. The demo can be enjoyed even if you've never played a game in the Pikmin series before, so we hope you'll try it out when it releases. Yeah, sorry about that. That's in a week. Okay, let's see a few more headlines. 
Survive the jungle and confront your former mentor. You can also enjoy the games that started the series, Metal Gear and Metal yeah, Gear 2, the first game Solid really Snake, good. as well as the NES versions of both Metal Gear yeah. and Snake's Revenge. Yeah, NES version. This compilation also contains the first Metal Gear Solid digital graphic novel and its sequel. Additional it's pretty cool that there is all this, I guess, books with story and character info, people are really strategy uh, guides for each game, and a digital soundtrack. And that's nice, too. Metal Gear Solid Master it's Collection Volume 1 in -game. launches on Nintendo Switch October Instead of having, having to go, like, on YouTube to hear the new OST. On Nintendo eShop. The first three Metal Gear Solid games will also be available separately on Nintendo eShop. I like that about Super Smash Bros, for example, in the entire OST on the game. It's time to survive. Steal thyself. Vampire Survivors is coming to Nintendo Switch. Do you have what it takes to survive a 30-minute onslaught of monsters? Is this Stay on the move to avoid enemies and attack automatically with your weapons. Seems easy at first, right? But swarms of increasingly stronger monsters will appear the longer you survive. By getting treasure chests with the seem easy enemies, at all. or by leveling up, you'll acquire weapons and upgrades for your character. So shape them as you see fit. Plus, up to four players can now play together in Couch Co-op. What other horrors lie in store? Find out when Vampire Survivors launches on the Nintendo Switch system, August 17th. Music and pigeons? Sounds pretty cool. You're a pigeon. Yeah, you heard that right. Play online in this Rhythm Battle Royale and aim to be the last bird rhythm standing. Rhythm Battle Royale. Up to 30 players can ruffle each other's feathers in musical minigames. Copy the leader's actions perfectly in Yes Commander. Fire a slingshot to play music in First Piano Shooter. Race and fly to the rhythm in To the Sky and more. With over 20 mini games, you're in for an impeccably good time. Get ready to shake yeah. those pigeon tails. I'm not sure about this. But... Rhythm Royale bops its way onto Nintendo Switch October 31st. Ready, set, yo! Penny is on the run, entangled in a chaotic audition that veered way off script. Oh, She's that looks managed cool. to make some powerful enemies and a newly animated friend. In this 3D platforming adventure from the team behind Sonic Mania, you'll explore oh. the bright and colorful well, that, world of Macaroon. That sounds great. And help Penny and Yo Yo escape the Sonic clutches Mania's of the grouchy Emperor pretty good Eddie. Game. Perform stylish acrobatic tricks to avoid Eddie's massive horde of pushy penguins and power up yo-yo to protect penny from foul play you can also put your speed running skills to the test in time attack mode to unlock special items complete secret stages and more this is your big break after all take the stage when penny's big oh, break looks cool. launches on nintendo switch early next year a yeah, great game Okay, uh, now that's the thing. I have the booster, of course. Okay, that's the new course. course. Racing into wave five of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. Introducing Squeaky Clean Sprint. Squeaky Clean Sprint. More characters are also being added. Oh, PD Piranha. Mario Kart Double Dash. PD Piranha. From Mario and Wiggler. Kart 7, Wiggler. From Mario Kart and Tour, Cam. Comet. 
that's the coolest one. Wave five of the Mario Kart Deluxe Booster Course. People will be happy about PD Piranha as well, I guess. Game zooms onto Nintendo Switch this summer. Active Nintendo Switch Online Plus expansion pack members can enjoy this, this DLC okay. at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Two worlds, one fateful encounter. A remake of the second Star Ocean game, complete with new graphics that fuse 2D and 3D, is cool. on the way. I really like After graphics like this. Goes wrong, Federation officer Claw sure. is stranded on an undeveloped planet. There, he meets Reyna, who possesses mystical powers. Was it fate or mere coincidence? Soon after, knows? the two get entangled in a sinister plot within the galaxy. In this science fantasy RPG, select either Claude or Reyna as your hero and play through the story from their perspective. You'll also meet over a dozen potential allies from all walks of life. During your adventure, the hero you chose and the decisions you make will have an impact on who can be recruited to your cause. Okay, that's, that's Battles so cool. take place in real time and skills can be performed with a single button. New combat features in this remake include stunning enemies with chain attacks and having allies not in your current party unleash follow-up attacks, letting you map out strategic battles in your favor. There are too many numbers for me to understand. For a way home, an ancient prophecy will unfold and your destiny will be awakened. Save the planet you... in Star Ocean, the second story R. Speaking French for no reason. November 7th. Japanese games. 101. It's time to move it Wario style. Get ready for more micro game mayhem in the latest WarioWare game. Hold two Joy Con controllers, then action. Move your body to take on a flurry of lightning fast micro games. What you do and how you move depends on the micro game. React quickly with the right movement, and you'll be on the road to victory. Excellent! If you've got two pairs of controllers, play with a friend in local co-op. Sync up your actions to beat each micro game. Plus, up to four players can live it up across various mini games in party mode. For example, this dicey board game is going to keep you on your but toes. But you need like four pairs of controllers. Get your body moving in Favorite over 200 players. lightning fast micro games. In WarioWare, move it. Launching on the Nintendo Switch system November 3rd. November. Pre orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. It's funny because he's moving. he's moving. He was so into it, I didn't want to interrupt. Anyway. This is the latest WarioWare game. You'll use your entire body to strike different poses and complete micro games. Okay, I think there will be one more final. We have a few more things to share. Oh. Still. Families can join the fun at Nintendo Live 2023. Play games. Enjoy live performances. Take photos with some of your favorite characters. Seattle's pretty far. And more. Plus, cheer on your favorite players in two championships. Eligible attendees can also compete in on-site tournaments and participate in a last chance qualifier. This all-ages celebration is free and will take place September 1st through 4th in Seattle, Washington. Registration for Nintendo Live 2023 ends June 22nd. Head over to the official website and enter the random drawing for a chance to receive tickets. PAX West badge holders interested in attending can visit the official PAX West website for more details. Those not selected will have another chance to attend with the three Challenge Cups this summer. The top 10 players from each will get tickets. Please visit the official website for more details. See you there! A vast number of players are enjoying their time in Hyrule in The Legend of Zelda I know. the Kingdom which released last month. I have a Twitch account, Thank so I know. Very much. An amiibo figure of Link from the game was released to coincide with the game's launch. New amiibo of Zelda 
and Ganondorf are planned to be released this holiday. We hope you're looking forward to them. Okay, okay. this next segment One. will be our last yeah. announcement. Final Please take a look. Space. How is that? Is Mario on drugs? I was wondering. I wonder what this game will be about. Okay. So we have confirmation in five playable characters. Oh. I'm Is Yoshi a playable character or is he just a friend? Like a... an NPC? No, I think you can play as Yoshi, okay. That's pretty cool. Okay, in October... Mario becomes a fur. That was the brand new 2D side scrolling Mario game. Oh my god, there's gonna be furry more. Wonder. When you touch a wonder, do you know what you just transformed E621 into? The ground could start moving, or you might turn into something different, for example. There were also flowers talking. Daisy is playable. And Mario became an elephant at the end. A lot of things happened. We'll share more details in the future, so we hope you'll look forward to it. Okay, well. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. That looked pretty cool, I guess. Thank you for watching. But still no information about Metroid Prime. The fans must have a patience. Really? Okay, well. Um... I mean, there were a lot of Mario announcements, definitely, uh, like they showed the Mario Kart, Mario Kart things, like three new characters in one of the courses, I guess that's pretty cool. Though I'm really interested about the Peach game and the new Super Mario 2D game, the Super Mario Bros. Wonder. Um, I know that there's also the Luigi's Mansion remake, I guess that's, that's cool as well, and also the Super Mario RPG remake. Uh, they showed more information about Pikmin 4. Um, but honestly, I don't, I don't think they showed that many like new games. I'm really happy about Dragon Quest Monsters. Uh, that's pretty cool, though. And yeah. Uh, I don't know what else uh, to say. I guess I'll be ending this video here. Uh, but yeah, it was pretty cool still to react to this. I, I would have preferred to be more prepared, uh, but I didn't have much time. So yeah, thank you guys so much for uh, watching this, and uh, I guess I will be seeing you guys next time.